And now, your Storm Team 2 forecast with meteorologist Tara Hastings. And we're going to see a possibility of a few light showers this evening, generally mostly cloudy skies through the evening. Temperatures falling into the lower 70s. It's still going to be pretty muggy. And just in time to start your Monday morning commute, we're going to see another round of rain. Could be on the heavier side. And then a few scattered showers possible during the afternoon hours with those temperatures climbing into the upper 70s, close to that 80 degree mark. Definitely had a soggy weekend across most of the Miami Valley. Fort Loramie, our two day total. Uh, 2.95 inches, almost three inches of rainfall, and eaten about an inch and uh, a half almost. And in Dayton, 1.16 inches, and 1.2 of that was received today, which broke a daily rainfall record. It's going to be pretty mild and muggy for the night tonight, once again, with those dew point values in the upper 60s and lower 70s. So another night where you're definitely going to need the air conditioning. And then, yes, we are going to see some more rainfall heading this way on Monday. Our SVG motor camera shows dry conditions over in Greenville. And right now on Live Doppler 2 HD, a few light showers in Logan County and also in Butler County, and just a few spotty showers here in Shelby County along 75. Otherwise, that's just about it. We have lots of clouds in place, but we still have this stream of moisture moving in from the southwest heading into the Miami Valley. So still going to see the chance for some rain pushing in here heading into your Monday. Right now, we're sitting at 75 in Greenville. It's 76 in Troy, 77 in in Xenia, and now it's uh, 73 degrees currently in Wapakoneta. Officially at Dayton International Airport, where we broke that daily rainfall record, 76 degrees right now. Very light winds out of the west, and the dew point a very uncomfortable 70. Our future track forecast model shows just a few isolated showers possible this evening, mostly cloudy skies. And as we begin your Monday morning, mainly cloudy conditions with a good chance to some moderate to heavy rain to start off the day, and then scattered conditions as we go into the afternoon. More rain will be possible as we head into Tuesday as well. But as the days wear on throughout the week, those rain chances are going to decrease. That's definitely some good news here. Many of you are probably going to need to uh, mow your lawn here pretty soon with all that water that we've had. 68 degrees tonight, mostly cloudy, warm, and muggy. We'll get up to about 82 degrees through the day tomorrow. Again, a best chance of rain will be for the first part of the day. It's still going to be rather warm and humid. In your Storm Team 2 seven day forecast, up to 82 degrees on your Tuesday with a few scattered showers or thunderstorms, 83 on Wednesday. And notice the percentages are decreasing there here as we go through the mid and latter half of the week. Temperatures still staying into the middle 80s there. As we head into the weekend, we are going to see a cold front move through, it looks like, on Saturday that will eventually uh, bring us some dry conditions heading into Sunday. So crossing our fingers, it will, looks like Sunday may be the best dry day that I can guarantee you. That's good. I